Oh hey, this is Trav. What a beautiful day it is today. I thought I'd just talk a little bit about birdhouses, give you a little more information. Here's a couple of birdhouses that I recently built. Here's a hanging style birdhouse that I built. Uh, just take your square basic shape and turn it into a diamond, giving you a pointed bottom. This one has a cedar top and just some salvaged materials, some old painted boards that I found. For ventilation, I've got a gap right here, and air can pass through that gap and right out this hole, and it provides for, for good ventilation for your birds. The clean out on this one, if you loosen this screw, the side door opens up, you can get right in there and clean out all the old nest material. And year after year, that's important to do. This keeps your birdhouse ready for new occupants every, every spring. So I'm going to hang this one up here and show you this A-frame style birdhouse. I built this one also out of salvage materials. Designed this one to be a wall hanger. It's just got a wire loop right there. And I got this corrugated metal roof. I really like this design for predator avoidance. That shape makes it tough for a predator to get in, uh, get those, those baby birds. And with it hanging up high on a, on a wall or a fence or a tree, tough for predators to get to as well. Now this, this rustic A-frame birdhouse, I really like the overhang on the, the corrugated metal. Just gives it a rustic look. And the clean out on this one's right here on the bottom. Grab hold of this screw. It opens up like so. You can remove all the old nest material. I just put a screw right there as a stop so when I close the door, it pushes against it. So this one's ready to be put out and see if we can attract some birds. I wanted to talk uh, just a little bit more about birdhouses in general. There's really no limit to the number of birdhouses you can build. So over the years I've built a lot of different kinds of birdhouses, some with flat bottoms, some with a pointed triangle or diamond shape, metal roofs, wood roofs. I've even used cottonwood uh, log an old, out of an old snag where a woodpecker had built a hole and then I just, just took that log and built a roof on it. I used a, an old watering can once, just, uh, just for fun, you know. Make birdhouses out of gourds, out of any number of different things. One of my favorite things about birdhouses is that they're fun to build. And they're relatively easy to make. You're really only limited by your own imagination. Here are some birdhouses that I made for my kids. Now I built these out of new materials and then the kids painted them however they wanted. I really like rustic birdhouses, but you can build them out of new materials or anything really that you can find. It's fun and challenging to try different designs.